This video is now brought to you by GeekRetreat.com Who oh, what's up people, Dobson was right here and welcome to another Yu-Gi-Oh! pack opening. Now it's gonna get serious ladies and gentlemen. Please check out GeekRetreat.com and today we are opening up something from the past and it's something I wanted to open up a little bit more in in the future because like I said these are no longer around anymore but I know a good secret um, a secret person who still has some and so I bought them off him yes these are not from Geek Tree, but still I've got them Jewel Overlord we got a whole box and we got some spare packs what am I hoping to get out of this pack out of this set literally anything I'm talking about the freaking Awesome meta cards. There's so many meta cards in here, and also you get an oversized card in here. Oh, nice. We got ourselves a tour guide from the underworld. Very nice. I'll put that to the side. Thank you very much. So, there's anything in this set that I really do want, but the main card I really do want is, of course, the Relinquish card. Or the the Link five headed dragon, which would be amazing. Crystalon. Oh, any of them. There's, there's so many great cards in this set. There really is. But we got a lot of packs open, people. We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 packs. There's 5 cards in a pack. That's over 50 holographics in there, people. That's insane. Now, I'm about 60 hollows. Without further ado, though, let's open them up. Let's see if my luck is still on my side. Let's see if we can get some metas and some very expensive cards. Oh, you got to be kidding me for the very first time. We get the first meta card already. Christian Helix Cracks. Awesome sauce right there. So I'm gonna probably put the meta cards to the, to the left and probably put the ones to the right. But like I said, I will put the price of the pack depending on what cards are in it. In value depends. The Chaos Goddess, Friar Brand. Oh my God, that's an amazing pack. Two meta cards right there. I'm actually gonna sleeve up the metas to be honest because I do know what the meta cards are. I have been learning, okay, people. I have been learning, <laughs> but awesome. Two meta cards already. Very good. Next pack. But the main, main one, I, the main one I want is the Relinquish card. That's a card I really want. Nice. We got ourselves Sky Striker Ace. That's a good card for your, for your decks. Uh, Dalmaticas. Uh, Umbrella. Uh, Giga Plant. Nice. A Ultra Celestial. That's good. That's actually a really good card, as you guys know. It's for your Phoenix Enforcer for Destiny Heroes. Oh, come on, let's go. Cynet Mining. Good card. Malefic Divide. Watch your wrath. Triple D Abyss King Gilgamesh. Bloody hell, Final Fantasy is in here. And a Mystical Space Typhoon. Actually, yeah, I'm sleeving up Mystical Space Typhoon. It's an amazing card. Everybody uses it. Put it right there. Next pack. We got our Spirit. We got Witchcrafter Minda. Last Royal in another planet. Bloom Harmonisha. Malefic Tune. Okay, so we got. I'm, like, I've just figured, figured out that we got Malefics in this set. So probably they're the ones that we don't really want to get because they are not highly desirable. Oh, you gotta be kidding! <laughs> Infinite impermanence! Oh my god! <laughs> Let's go! I've now got two copies of this. Let's go! That's awesome! Awesome sauce right there. There is another trap card that I want, which is um, evenly matched. I need two more copies of that. But getting myself an infinite impermanence is awesome. That is going right there. Scrap the most evolution pill. Sirenetto flowing. An abyss actress. Oh my god, that is an amazing pull right there. Infinite impermanence. Ultra rare. I know it's the most it's I know it's not the most expensive version of it. I think the most expensive version is of course the ultimate rare version from the OTS packs. But I don't care about the ra the rarity of it, really. I just want it. That is good. Can we get another copy of it? Get myself a third copy of it. It would be amazing, people. It would be amazing. There we go. We got five-headed link dragon. That can actually use that in one of my decks, to be honest. Probably one of my burning decks. Vanity's ruler. Malefic territory. Nice. We got ourselves the flame swordsman. And a scrap or offer. Okay. 
That's actually a really, really good card to be nice for your Warriors. Oh, why am I sleeving them all up? My bad. Why am I doing that for some weird reason? <laughs> Lol, whoopsies! Put them up there. They weren't like the biggest, biggest hitters there. The well, next pack. What can we get next? We got Makiasi Mayhem. Magical Casper. Divide. Secret Six Samurai. Fuma. That's nice. Uh, dangerous Fright for a Nightmare. Okay, some Fright Furs again. Nice to see them coming back again. Um, into my eyes. I love my Fright Furs. They are fun to face, but I don't like facing them though. Uh, World Key Blade Master. Speed Ride. Love it. Tune. Cubics. Golden Castle of Strongberg. That's a good card. I like that a lot. We got four packs left. Can we get any other meta cards? Can we get another infinite permanence? Or can we get evenly matched? Oh, nice. Night Lord Parshaft. That's good. We get ourselves the Protector Whelp, the Destruction Swordsman. Zombie World. Hey, we get another one. Very good. Animal Jammer Emperor. Wow. Okay. That's really good. But right there, another meta card right there for my collection for metas. Very good. Third pack in now. Let's have a look. Witchcraft. Emperor Taiju. Mirai's Light. Divide. And a Watch Giraffe. Okay. That's definitely a big dud, that one. <laughs> got Rose Bell. Speed Ride. Number 27. A card that's definitely banned. I know that card's banned. And another one of them. Okay. Final pack of Destiny. Can we get evenly matched, people? That's, what, that's definitely a card I absolutely really do want. It's the one card I really do want. Well, Key. Scrap, another bad card, alien, and a dark luma dragon. Never mind, we didn't get ourselves evenly matched, but hey, we pulled some great matters right there. But sadly, no anaconda either. But infinite impermanence is one of the best cards to pull, I think. Definitely one of the best ones, and possibly as well, Christian as well. But either way, I'm sure you knew what we pulled. They're the best pulls, I think, out of all of them. Probably the best one to me is definitely the trap card, Infinite Impairments. If you guys enjoyed it, I surely did. Make sure you smash the like button as always. Comment down below. And if you're brand new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. I want about 87% of you guys who watch my YouTube videos are not subscribed. So what the hell are you doing? Subscribe, for God's sakes. With that being said, the people I'm still going to see you guys for subscribing. And I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! I can't believe that. We pulled ourselves some quite big hitter metas right there. Definitely for that one. Let's go! I like getting these. These are nice. I don't have a clue what the values are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Oh! Oh! Let's